Good morning, everybody. It's Dr. Kemi Ululaya. It is 7 a.m. in Lagos, Nigeria, and today is the 25th of February, 2020. I'm here to tell you guys that what happened in Shagamu State yesterday amounts to a massacre, okay? Starting on Saturday, a football player was shot and killed over there, allegedly by SARS police officers, the Special Armed Robbery Squad. Now, when you are a Special Armed Robbery Squad, you better be shooting, okay, somebody that has just committed a violent robbery and you shouldn't be shooting them and killing them you should be like maybe injuring them maybe if they're running away from the scene of the crime but if they're not even an armed robber i'm seeing a lot of shooting by sars police brutality is unaccepted right now i want to talk to you about what happened in shagamu yesterday because it amounts to a massacre that's what they call it in the English language. When you start killing one, two, three, four, five people, you're massacring people, you're destroying communities. Keep talking. Mushimansol American, am I dake? Keep talking. Because at today point in Nigeria Tepe, Ijobalati Laju. Ijobalati Laju. We're a country, so Jekwe, half of the population. More than half of the population, more than 50% of the population are young people. Everybody needs to start talking. Okay, as an activist, must you retire? As a retired activist, okay, there's so much you can do with fights. I have fought and fought and fought and fought for people. Canada, US, Nigeria, we're all fighting this one. Revolution to Basu Johnny Bikabashi White to Leon, Ulu Berry, Nisha Gamulano, Timuria, when you're talking, no more sas, no more sas. Do we still need SARS? My grandfather was the first deputy IGP in this country, retired in 1951, Chief Samuel Akiemi. Shashi needs SARS because half of the stuff to SARS and she now has nothing to do with armed robbers. I used to support SARS because I lived with armed robbers in Potaka prison during my journalism case. But now, do we really need them? Are they doing their job? It is time. It is time to review these things, President Buhari. We're crumbling as a country.